Hi folks, this is Max from Nexus10Root.com. So today I'm going to show you how to root your Nexus 10 uh, using a Mac OS 10, OS X, OS 10, whatever. Um, so go ahead and uh, make sure you make a backup of everything on your internal storage of the Nexus 10 because this will erase everything on your Nexus 10. So go ahead and uh, hold down, once you've done that, hold down the uh, power button, volume up, volume down, all these three buttons up here, all the three buttons until you re reboot into um, the bootloader fast boot mode. This is called the fast boot bootloader mode. Um, you'll see it says locked. So first thing we're going to do is connect it to our computer via micro USB cable. And let's go to our Mac OS X. Next go ahead and open up a browser and type uh, download androidrom.com or um, you can just go st straight to the link um, if you want and also go browse down to Nexus 10 and go down go to uh, Nexus 10 root new dot zip this has all the files you need um, to root your Nexus 10 you don't need anything else you don't have to download the SDK um, just only 15 megabytes here so go ahead and download it um, this will download should take uh, 20 seconds or whatever um, and once it's downloaded we will unzip this and uh, do a couple things. So I'll be back when this is done downloading. Alright, it's almost done downloading. Um, go ahead and open it. Alright. And um, you'll see a bunch of files in it. And this should be um, this should be in your downloads folder. So if it should be under downloads. Uh, Nexus 10, yeah. So it automatically unzip uh, in my case. You know, unless you did something, it should do that. Next, open up a terminal. Go to Applications and uh, open up a terminal here. Uh, go to Utilities, sorry, and uh, open up a terminal. All right, and uh, go ahead and type here uh, CD Downloads. Enter and type CD. Uh, Nexus 10 root new uh, and enter and next type um, dot slash fast uh, actually you know what type this first chmod space 755 space star this will um, change all the permission of the files so it will be able to execute it so next we're going to type um, dot slash fast boot dash mac space oem space unlock alright and this will unlock your Nexus 10 um, you still have to do this. Go ahead and select yes on your Nexus 10 and uh, click the power button. You'll, it should say OK OEM unlock. Then you're good to go. And go ahead and hit the power button again. And this will restart your Nexus 10 and also reset everything, erase everything. So you'll have to re sign in. So I'll be back when this is done. Hi, right, folks. So once it's rebooted, um, go ahead and sign in and uh, do, the, do the usual thing. All right, once signed in, we're going to go ahead and download a file from the uh, the web. So go open up your browser and go to downloadandroidrom.com. All right, and browse to uh, browse down to uh, tools directory down here, tools, and go to super su directory here, and go download the latest version of CWM super su blah blah dot zip which at this point of this video is 0 0.98 and uh, wait five seconds here and you can download the file um, the reason why we do this after unlocking bootloader is when you unlock the bootloader it, uh, everything gets erased so that's why we have to do it after um, so when that's done go ahead and reboot your Nexus 10 into bootloader mode go ahead and hold down power volume down and volume up um, there we go Whoa. And uh, wait a second here. And there you go. Go ahead and connect it back to your. Oh, sorry, no. Ver yeah, yeah. Go ahead and connect it back to your your uh, computer. And let's go back to our computer real quick. Next, we're going to type. Uh, we're going to flash the clock for my recovery. So go ahead and type dot slash fastboot dash mac uh, space flash space recovery space recovery. 
and then hit the tab key it'll fill it in for you this is the clock working clockwork model recovery and hit enter and this will send the recovery to your Nexus 10 so you now have uh, clockwork model recovery installed and let's go back to the tablet real quick you can uh, unplug it you don't need this anymore and we're almost done here um, go down to recovery using the volume buttons and hit the power button when you see recovery mode and this will boot you into clockwork mode recovery uh, where you can install the actual routing files and there we go we're here go to install zip from SD card go to choose zip from SD card and then hit zero and go to download and uh, click on the CWM super blah blah dot zip and click on yes and this will install the files you need go back reboot system now should have a fully rooted uh, Nexus 10 tablet with clockwork mod recovery installed and also root and super user uh, super SU in this case super user and super SU they're same things um, pretty much does the same things I prefer super SU since uh, it has in the settings you can actually do one click unroot if you want and once you have reboot it you should find super SU app there and to verify that you do have um, you know full root you can download an uh, app called titanium backup so if you write tit it'll actually show you titanium backup that's kinda cool huh? um, go ahead and accept and uh, download and you should be all good to go and uh, go ahead and open and boom shakalaka you have uh, root grant um, there you go you have a fully rooted uh, Nexus 10 Anyway, if you have a Nexus 10, don't forget to sign up for my email list at nexus10root.com. We update you once a week with Romilly Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe up there. And uh, uh, have a great day. And stay high on Android. That was how to root your Nexus 10 on Mac, o Mac OS 10. And also, I have a Windows method and Linux method. If you want to see those, it's in the description. And also on my site, nexus 10 root. Com. And also check the FAQ on uh, that site. It has everything you need um, for all the different root methods. Anyway, see you guys later. Have a great day.